it's your boy KL man and um I'm having a little quick update. Um I know I said before I was like, Oh well my monitor cord and stuff and and um I couldn't really do a lot of stuff because um my monitor cord. Now the computer just pretty much bit the dust. So it's gonna be a hot minute before I get any video game videos up. Any recolor videos up, or any videos like that nature. Like I can do, I can keep doing like the the webcam rants and all that stuff. But and I'm mad I can't even like get on like Skype because Skype doesn't work with my um computer like that. Um, which is, but I do have a tiny chat though because that's like a browser based one. And um. Yeah, matter of fact, I guess I I put the tiny chat uh, the tiny chat up there, um, you know, so people they can follow and hit me up on my uh my little profile and and stuff on there, and um like we can talk and stuff. But today's topic is actually came to me in talking with a bunch of people on tiny chat was um was pretty much voice actors in general. And, um, to me, when it comes to subs and dubs, I'm equal. Some, some subs I like better than, um, the dubs, and then some dubs, I'm like, I mean, no, yeah, some, some dubs is like, yo, man, they, you don't need to watch the sub for that. You can get all of that in your language there, right there. It was good. It was real good. Um, but, um, I'm, I'm equal when it, when it comes to both of those and stuff, and I do have my share of favorite voice actors, I mean, yeah, um, in fact, my top ones is this, first we start from the low to the low, the low to the low, the low to the low, low to the low, um, we have, we have your boy, we had your boy, um, we had your boy, damn, I don't finna fuck up the name, see, I'm stopping cause I don't wanna fuck up people's name, you have, yeah, you have, Sheen Shimu right there, I had to make sure I didn't wanna fuck up his name, you have Sheen Shimu right there, then after, then after him, no, you have, you know, you have Vic first, then after him, you have, uh, Sheen Shimu, then, um, after that, you have Chris, and then after that, you have freaking, um, Steve Bloom, then after that, you have David Hayter, the best, like, fucking voice actor, I, yeah, I know, he, 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 he didn't, he, he wasn't, like, everywhere, but, Bro, his 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 voice and skills is crazy. I mean, come on, Snake. Come on, you want to have that nigga voice? Like, come on, just a Snake. Yeah, all the con and all that. I swear, yo, like that that dude's a beast, man. When it when it when it comes to vo uh the voice acting and stuff, man, he's a beast. And there's also some uh, uh those are my top, but there's there's other voice actors and stuff I um I like and and stuff like. Like, there's some voice actors that get some hate. I don't know why, because they like the coolest people on the panel. And they have some really good or okay performances. Like, like, like freaking, um, um, Kyle Herbert. The, the guy that does the, the, the narration for Dragon Ball Z. He does Gohan's voice. And he, um, he does Ryu's voice from the Street Fighter 4 series. Um, he's really good. And, you know, but I don't know why he got haters. Because I swear, like, every time, like, you see the panel and stuff, you know, it feels like you win, like, a freaking wrestling show. Like, everybody's hyped and having fun and jokes are going around. And he has no boundaries. Like, only thing he won't he won't really answer is like sexual personal freaking questions. I mean, who want to answer that? You know, that's, that's getting real deep in that. Anyway, but he got no boundaries, man. And he and he free minded. That dude would tell you what his aspects on things, man. He would he would clearly tell you. 
and the, there's no language barrier with him either. It's like for real, like y'all could be cussing up a storm like sailors, and the thing still go well, you know. Um, also, Greg Aries, he been getting a uh. Whew, that dude been getting some hate for like a long time. I mean, to me, he's a, he's a decent he's a decent uh voice actor. You know, he he um he voice act Kayuki real good. Cause you know when um when I first got a hold of Beck, you know um Beck actually is the anime that got me more into the the rock side. I mean, I liked the rock. And punk rock and all that before, but it got me more di um, into that side, you know, watching that anime, like Spice of the Life. <laughs> like I love that. I, I love back, man. I, I love that anime. It's so so beast, man. Love it. And he was he was the uh, he was Koyuki, the, the the main character. And he did it well. Did it real well. Um, he did other characters and stuff I, I heard pretty good. He, he, he did it well. Um, but yeah, he, he get a lot of hate and, and he get a lot of people who hate, hate his voice. Now, this is funny. I know I can hear the Naruto fans is going to try to whoop my ass. But like I said before, my other videos, I don't give a fuck. But anyway, um, freaking Sasuke's voice that I forgot his name because I try to forget that guy because he's fucking everywhere he's in like mad video games and like everywhere I'm tired of hearing his voice because I freaking uh, I I freaking hate Sasuke now yeah I, as you can say I, I was your typical like Naruto like freaking like fan dude but but even Naruto just like threw me to the side and was like like for for like he like he threw all what his his goals mainly was you know for Sasuke and all that stuff and then it started to get really bad for you know when he he wanted to like save and bring Sasuke back and all so it just got to extreme level and I was like you know what man Naruto you still cool but eh, this stuff is really and then it gets to a very homo extend as well too. I'd be like, "You taking it that far, man? Like, are you serious?" And then you can hear the freaking gallery fan girl just eating that stuff up. Oh my god, they're eating that up! Like, whew, they just, they they just mad eating that up. Um, but um, uh, I mean, Naruto, he, he he's still my nigga, man. He's, he's still cool. I'm just saying, like now he's not he's not my favorite favorite anymore because like his character just went through a whole complete not not whole complete 360. Let me rephrase that. He went through like just a a change. He just threw that and took his mind and just put it on Sasuke. But um now and not because I'm actually I actually like every time I always come like to my my friends and stuff. You know they way ahead in, in Naruto. Reason why I'm not ahead. And Naruto like that because I actually tried doing um reading the manga and stuff and getting like fastly ahead. But the problem is though, most like sites and stuff I go go to with, with the manga, it it acts retarded. Well, let me rephrase that because retarded is offensive. It acts stupid. Is stupid better. It acts stupid. Um. And it just, it just gets, it, it just like, I'm trying to, and then, and then most times when you get to these very important parts and you got all, all this stuff that's going on, you have to completely flip the page back. And really, cause, just don't get me wrong. I, I love to read. <laughs> Those don't, no, that's what a lot of manga fans say, you know, to the anime fans. They're like, oh, I see why you just love anime because you can't read. No, 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 no. I can read because. I'm like reading all the Pokemon manga out because the anime is not really doing that that shit justice at all. <laughs> it's really not, and I'm watching um the the manga. I said watching, reading the the manga um of the Pokemon stuff. I got a lot to go through 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 all that. So I I love to read. All right, it just we dealing with some complex stuff like Naruto and stuff. It it's it, you know you want it to be in an anime and 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 an animation because you can just suck all that in and one go and be like yeah you know
know what I'm saying? And that's kind of with the subs as well. That's that's one reason why I'm I'm actually with the dub now because um the subs guy I, I ain't no I ain't no no sub hater. The sub the sub is good. It just the sub has the same thing when I'm when I'm dealing with when I'm when I was trying to look at the manga and get ahead was when so much stuff is going on you gotta play back and bring it back all the time and then, you know and it just it just get like damn hey, how many times I gotta bring it back to to fully get the whole picture because you gotta you gotta read all that stuff with all this going on and I'm far sided not near sided most computers is up like this and. Sometimes I can I I can't see everything in the whole complete like package. Now if I'm far away I can, but I don't like. But come on, man! Like, I don't, I want to be all the way over there and people looking at me like, oh, that's that's retarded and stuff. That's why I don't, I don't know. I th I think I do need like what near sighted glasses probably. Yeah. Anyway, that's 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 something I gotta think about. But um. But when I'm watching the anime, man, it just, it just feels so smooth. And I just get through the whole thing um, very smooth. So, um, so I'm actually is um, going with the the dub on on this one. So that's that's why I can't say I'm a um, I'm a like freaking diehard Naruto fan. I mean, I I I love that anime, and the anime is. is it's juicy and stuff, but I'm not a dog because, you know, I, I, I won't go that much links because of some of my boundaries, you know. I won't go that much links. And then, and then, and then also, since when I first caught Naruto, it wasn't in the manga, I caught it in the anime because I'm a big freaking Toonami fan. That, that's one reason why Steve Bloom is in, is in my top freaking um, voice actors and stuff because... Steve Bloom was like my childhood. Every time, bro, every time I came, like what, like fourth, fifth, freaking grade, third grade, I used to come home and like do the homework, get some candy and stuff, and then two nine would come, like, oh my god, Dragon Ball Z and stuff. And that's what that's what and Dragon Ball Z is actually um, a thing that me and my father has, you know, like we have links to you know me and my father we had some stuff in common because i actually got my father into a whole bunch of anime he's like what 40 40 something i don't be trying to pay attention to my dad age man because he gonna get that old i'm be like no daddy shut up <laughs> but um <laughs> but i got him so like, i got him in Yasha and i'm I, well and well speaking of since i broke up Yasha, um Imiyasha was okay and decent to me. It felt like a long marathon that never stopped, though, <laughs> you know. But it was it was a really it was a really um good anime. Now I'm not a I, it's kind of the same thing with me and Naruto with this thing. Like I love I love the thing, but I'm not a freaking diehard freaking fan, boy. Because I swear it was sometimes, man, when I was watching Imiyasha, I was like, wait, did I see the same thing again? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? But and then sometimes I was like, man, Kagome, man, just shut the fuck up, please. So, but um, that was one. Um, there, there, there's like I think three or four anime. Me and my father, you know, we sit down there and watch together. Dragon Ball Z is one of them. me and him just nerd out with with Dragon Ball Z, man, all the time, you know. And um, something me and my father, you know. Can always connect with. I guess he get older. We told Jam, I was like, oh yeah, I remember the yeah, I remember the jump with Goku did the command man, and it completely like blast through freaking uh, Boo, but he was still alive, and you know, but um, <laughs> but um, uh, damn, I kind of got off subject there. Ooh, that sucked. Um, rewind. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And yeah, I was talking about the, the the dub and stuff, but yeah, I'm actually is going with with the English dub this time, you know. And I get a lot of Naruto fans, people come at and be like, "Bird man, oh my God, you you back here, man? You back here? You need to catch up, man? Man, oh my God, you stupid man?" And all that, and that's kind of one thing that actually do 
tur- turn off a lot of late Naruto fans that actually got in the anime first before the manga, or actually, like, just got to the show and just started with the anime, and every time they go to conventions or something else, they get freaking, like, demolished, man, and how you just gonna do that to your fans, man, I mean, they, they probably don't know as much as you do, I swear, I don't do that to none of Dragon Ball Z fans that's just new to Dragon Ball Z, um, and they just come, come through there and stuff, most of these people are, are little kids, a little young ones, and they just, you know, got into Dragon Ball Z and stuff, and and I don't be going in there, but, oh my god, bro, you suck, you ain't know what happened to Goku, and blah, 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 you know, I, I ain't doing all that, you know, I mean, that's what they do, I swear that's what they do, and, yeah, but that's, that's my situation and stuff, um, with Naruto, but as I was talking about with the, um, the voice actors with, with Greg, man, Greg, he's, he's pretty decent, but a lot of people hate him, and like I was saying with, with Sasuke, man, I fucking hate that. I, I hate. Uh, I, I don't hate the guy. I hate Sasuke and I hate that voice. <laughs> I really do. Like, oh, I just hate it, man. I don't know. I just hate people like that, man. Just, just, yeah, it just grinds my gears, man. But um, he, he's everywhere. He's in Resonance Evil 6. He's in Saints Row. Um, the third and Saints Row Two, like he's in s- everywhere. Cause I remember Saints Row Two, he played as, um, I forgot the guy's name, but he was the le- um, he was the, no, his dad was like, the leader of the the operation that was running, but he was like the leader of the gang, and it was like Sasuke's voice, and I forgot, I forgot what the guy's name. He, he was with the Ronin, the Ronin gang, the yellow um gang. Now, I won't say Asian game because they actually have black people and Asians in that game. But, um, he was in, he, he was voice acting as the leader of that. And he was like, he was like all over the place. I don't know, it's just his voice, man. I don't know, it's, it's just, when I heard from Sasuke, man, it, it just killed me. I was like, I was like, no, man. I wish I would have heard him do another character than Sasuke. And then every time I hear that voice, it thinks it's like, it's just, ah. But, um, yeah, but, but Graham, man, he's a cool guy. And then he also did a anti-bullying panel and all this stuff. Man, he's he's a really, he's a really good, a good, good voice actor, a good guy, man. A lot of people, they, they hate him. They be like, yo, I hate him. Like, I seen some dude, he was like the top annoying something character, anime something characters. And, like, he was like, he was like, he hated the character. Not, not because he, like, cross-dressed or whatever. And because he voiced that as freaking Greg Aries. And it was like... Oh my god, I hate his voice. And that's kind of how I'm with Sasuke. I'm sorry. But Greg, though, man, he's cool. He's cool. He's, he's real cool. Um. Oh, and I and I swear, I think freaking Christmas uh, Savage is going to choke the next person at his freaking panel. That's why he gets it over with. Each panel, he's like, I'm going to get it over, over 9,000. Don't ask me again. <laughs> But I swear, like, they always ask for that a lot. They don't ask for it. For, it's either over 9,000, the ball, or inert, or the, the towel woman thing. And Vegeta had so many freaking good lines. And, and no, and also Piccolo. Like, if next, if whenever I go to another panel and stuff and I see him, I'm going to ask him to do, I know he's going to be like, whoa, this is, this is the first time I actually do this line. In the Broly movie. Piccolo, he was talking to Vegeta, and Vegeta's like, we can't beat him, man, he's a, he's the legendary Super Saiyan, we can't beat him, man, he's too powerful, and then, uh, um, Piccolo's like, hey, it's people like, where's your Saiyan pride, and all that, and he was like, and he was like, well, stand clear of the true warriors, and he hold his hand like that, he dropped him, and he found him, and he's like, doom, 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 and he fall like, hit the ground, <laughs> and that, that was, like, my best lines, because that was the first thing I seen Vegeta just, like, well, other than that, the part with Freeza, but I seen Vegeta just completely just broke apart, even though he was Super Saiyan. Like, just stand clear of the true warriors. I was like, oh damn, Piccolo, he didn't have to do that while he dropping down. And then later on, he gets his pride. But I wanted to hear that like from him again, because you know that's the only time you can hear that line is in that movie. So stand clear of the true warriors. Like, oh my goodness. So where's your Saiyan pride? <laughs> but um. Yeah, that that guy he he he's uh 
He's pretty good. And I swear, like, that's why he loved doing freaking Vegeta, because you can have so much fun with that boy. Like, 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 every time he comes, like, it's like, well, I'm Vegeta. I hate everyone. <laughs> like, like, you can have, bro, it's like, if you can, like, have freaking Vegeta voice, like, you can have so much fun with it, man. And then, matter of fact, that guy's voice, you can have some of, like, some of the outtakes and stuff be having me freaking dying. And that's how Vic is, too, um, Vic Nyana. That's how he is, too, um, he, well, the, the character that I first knew, knew him about was with Broly, he freaking, he hate dubbing that thing, because, well, I said dubbing, well, yeah, dubbing also, like, saying the lines, because it's murder on his voice, man, but I just love it, it's Kakarot, Kakarot, and it's like, he's like, man, I can't be doing that, man, because it's, it's, it's like my, my throat, that's understandable, though, that's, that's understandable. I mean, you probably got to catch him in a real good mood for him to do, <laughs> to do that freaking voice. But um, he he's um he he's uh he, he's also um, a good one and a funny character. Cause now I'm not an all around host club fan. I I watched it cause a lot of anime fan and people was telling me like, yo, check it out, man. You gotta see this. So I took it out. I took it out. I checked it out. And like uh, I seen and all that, I was like, "Well, it's it, it's not bad." That's what I said. <laughs> it's it's it, it has some enjoyable moments. It's not bad. And then when I saw the outtakes for this thing, oh, then I then I was like, "Oh my god, they should have brought the comedy from the outtakes and put it in the anime." I swear, yo. It was, like you ever seen the Aura Host Club outtakes, yo? That joke is hilarious. Like 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 the part when um Vic. Vic was talking to, uh, the, oh, but, well, I, um, then I forgot what the guy named is, the senpai guy, when, you know, you know, the, the character Vic played as, and the guy was like, he was like, he's like, what's wrong, daddy, and then, like, you can hear it, <laughs> like, as he said, what's wrong, daddy, and then, and you can hear Vic in the, in the background, like, if you hear Vic, Vic is freaking dying, just laughing, he's like, he's just like, really, you, you, you expect me to freaking, like, respond to that? Like, after you just said that, like, the outtakes was just hilarious. And then, also, um, damn, I forgot who who did the voice of that. I think either, was it Colleen? Yeah, I think, yeah, it was it was Colleen. And she did, like, I think Hardy or something. And the funny part, she was, she was like, um, when it was at the beach, and it was the outtakes, it was like, when he's at the beach and stuff, and all the girls was just, he said, he said, mm, hello, he said, Ooh, I'm the sexy hottie. He said, I take all. She was like, I take all three of y'all. Mm -hmm. And I was rolling. I was like, yes! Yuri joke for the win! And stuff. And and stuff like that. But, I don't know. See, Yuri is, is, is just funny to me, man. It's, it's, it's funny, though. I don't know. Like, when, when females are females and stuff, like, you know, it's, it's, it's just, it's just, whew, I don't know. It's just funny. But, um, that just had me dying, man, on the outtakes. Like, those guys is hilarious, man. And then I actually uploaded both of the commentaries for Beck. And I swear, the second commentary of Beck always make me laugh, man. And, uh, like, it, it'd be, it'd be. And then that's, and they also said it stuff was, that was the first commentary that they can just go all out. Because it was like M.A. Ray, they can say, fuck. And all that stuff. And they were just going nuts, yo. And it was hilarious. I was just dying. Sitting there just watching that on, on my on, on, on my back. Uh, I got a whole complete series of back on DVD and stuff. And I was sitting there watching. I was just dying. Like, oh, my God. Did they just say that? Yo, that is hilarious. <laughs> and then when it first started, the, like, the dream. Dream to clean. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Oh, man. And it, it's just, I don't know. It's just Eric Vail and freaking... Justin Cook was, was also some, also my favorite act, uh, actors. They ain't my top, but they also my, my favorite uh, voice actors. And those guys were hilarious, man. I swear, yo. Like, especially freaking Justin Cook. Chiba was like the best fucking character. He always had me freaking dying. He was like, he was like, so what's the dream? I ain't never had the dream. So he's like, I always had a dream in, in um, polymorphic 3D. And I always remember the good ones. And then he was like, he was like, he said, he said, um, he said, but he said, so what's the dream about? He said, he said, don't worry about the dream. He's like, man, your noodles getting cold. He's like, fuck the noodles.
Toodles! And I was, I was rolling, yo. I don't know, man. It's like, when you give Justin um Cook that much freedom, yo, like, it's hilarious. Like, he can just go all out and just have you rolling, yo. But, yeah. Like I said, back, man, you gotta, gotta buy that. Gotta, gotta see that. See that. See it or buy it. Um, but... Man, it's, it's, it's so many freaking voice actors. So. And then also my favorite character in Dragon Ball Z, which would be Goku. Second is Vegeta, and third is Piccolo. Fourth is Trunks, and that's it. I mean, we got third is Gohan. I like the Gohan. He was that beast Gohan, not the Gohan, not the Gohan after when his like his soup like he's like he got real powered down because of all the schooling and all that stuff. And I don't like that Gohan. Same thing with trunks. Like I love, I, bro. Future trunk. I don't like the new trunks. I mean, yeah. I mean, let no, me no, 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 phrase that. So, blah, 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 blah. the new trunks, the kid trunks. You know, the voice by uh, Lord Bailey. Uh, Bailey. Bailey. There we go. Um, she did a good performance. It, it was good. I, I just don't. I, that trunks was okay. But I'm talking about, uh, let me rephrase myself, GT Trunks, <laughs> let me rephrase myself, that that was okay. GT Trunks was, no, like, why would you do Trunks like that, man? No, man, Trunks is like this epic freaking dude, man. Like, for real, man, it's, like, future Trunks, man, best freaking character ever. Ugh. Ugh. Well, that, that was, let me get my nerd him out. But, um, it, it's so many freaking good voice actors and, and voice talents and stuff. Same thing with, um, uh, same thing with, with Death Note, man. That, that potato chip line will never get, I swear, like, whenever, I'm actually do, no, actually, I, I ain't gonna do that. Man, I'm gonna do it. I ain't gonna let people know when, <laughs> so it won't be spoiled. But I'm gonna do it, man. Why? One day I'm just come on with a bag of potato chip. Dum -dum. Take this potato chip and eat it. I swear, yo, like I'm gonna do that one day. I'm gonna record it, man, just so it can be a laugh for me. So I just look at me being stupid and just <laughs> laugh. Oh my god, but that that epic potato chip eating. You don't get that in animes like that. You get well. I seen an anime that had epic. Pencil eating. Yeah. Eating a pencil. Yeah. But what what is the time? It's like twenty seven. Yeah. Um Oh yeah. Uh what else I got to freaking talk about? I know it was a little bit more I was gonna talk about. I just got sidetracked when I was nerding hard. Oh yeah. Um this is the, the hate they they give like the voice actors I, I just mentioned man I I don't know why these are really pretty um good working guys like good uh good per performant guys and whoa I don't know did I say pretty and let me phrase myself I ain't trying to sound <gasps> no but um you know what I mean these are they some really good voice actors man they just you know get some hate and stuff but. I seen most of their panels. They don't give a damn. It gives them more p publicity, but I, I just don't understand why, you know. But um, yeah. But um, like I was saying with with the the, the video, this was more of a, a discussion instead of rant. I know, like, I had two rant, like the rap one, like, um, the rap video, then the the me ranting about games and stuff, like how games been dying, and the other anime video and and some other stuff, but this ain't, this is just a discussion, really, oh, oh, I'm actually gonna have another video that I'm gonna, I'm gonna upload, um, like, both of them up today, um, this is gonna be one of them, but I have another one, and, boy, it's gonna be a doozy, a lot of people probably gonna hate me for it, it's gonna be a doozy, but, um, this being your boy, K.O., man, we're reaching, well, it's 29, finna be 30 minutes, I don't know if it's going to be fully 30 minutes, but we're reaching that limit. So hit me up in the mail.
Subscribe to a nigga. Y'all went all black. But subscribe to a nigga. Um, like I said, my, my tiny chat, I'll put it in the link, man. Hit me up. All that, man. You know, show me some love. Let me let me know what you want out and all that stuff, man. I will get on subjects. Give me a subject. And I'm out. Love, peace, anime fans, gamers, do your thing. I'm out.